red light therapy. Red light therapy has been shown to increase circulation, reduce pain. The wavelengths of near infrared uh, penetrate deep into the tissues, promoting vasodilation and enhancing your blood flow. We use it to increase blood flow and prime that mitochondria before your HBOT session. So when people come in, they lay on the red light therapy pad for 10 minutes before they do their hyperbaric oxygen. Because think about it, if it increases blood flow, now we're increasing blood flow right before we get into that high oxygen environment, push oxygen into our blood. And now that's flowing to all the tissues. Plus, and I'm not going to go deep into this, but inside the mitochondria, you need a substance called cytokinase. You need that to be able to convert the food that you eat with the oxygen into ATP and red light therapy primes that cytokinase in your, uh, in your mitochondria. Again, that's all I'm going to say. It just, it helps your cells produce even more ATP in the hyperbaric oxygen chamber. If you do the red light therapy first.